Hey guys, it's Nicola Milan from Singer's Secret. Now, not long ago, I did an introduction to scat singing video. And so with this video today, I'm going to show you how to start adding a little bit of scat singing into your songs in a way that is, I suppose for a lack of a better term, acceptable for pop music today or what might be popular. Scatting isn't as popular today as it used to be back when swing was king, you know, when jazz music was popular music. But you can still add it to your songs in a way that makes it sound really, really cool and is still kind of in fashion for music. So we're going to look at that in this video. So back in the day when jazz was king, they definitely had a lot more scatting injected into the songs. So if you listen to Ella Fitzgerald, for example, she would scat head after head after head. So she would basically go around the form of the song over and over and over again. And her voice literally became an instrument. So it became like um, a saxophone or a clarinet or any other horn. Um, yeah, you don't, I mean, you would get that in jazz clubs, but you wouldn't necessarily hear much of that on mainstream radio, except if you learn to inject it in a cool way. Now, Melody Gardot, one of my favorite singers, she's just like really cool uh, and she does this so well if you listen to some of her stuff. Her scanning is quite simple but it's also really catchy and it adds to the music and people love it. So we're going to break down one of her songs now and I'm going to show you how she adds some scat into her song Baby I'm a Fool. Melody Gardot's scat section kicks in at the 158 mark and what she does is she doesn't actually improvise the melody at all. She just sings uh, using scat syllables over the existing melody. So the bit that she sings over is this. Tell the truth, I think I should have seen it coming from a lie the way with the words you say. So what she does is I'm just going to do it with a la for now. La 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 la. But she adds scat syllables. So if you're new to scatting, then this is a really great way to sort of introduce yourself to it. You pick a piece of the melody, usually like the bridge or the B section that you want to scat, and just add scat syllables over the existing melody instead of having to come up with an improvised one. Melody Gardo's scat syllables are basically uh, Bela Dada repeated over and over again with a couple of bowls in there <laughs> so you have to keep, you just keep it really simple um, so it's something like really simple instead of la 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 so you can use that as a starting point firstly pick a section of song that you think you might want to scat use the existing melody instead of having to create an improvised one and then just stick to really simple scat syllables. And what makes her scatting so digestible in her songs is that it is only a small amount of scat. So really the entire bit of scat that she's added is kind of like And that's the extent of the scat, and she doesn't add it anywhere else. So you can use these steps to add scat to your song, and once you get better at it, you can then improvise the melody. So you kind of need to develop your musical hearing a little bit when you start getting into the improvised melody side of things but you've got a really great starting point to get you going for now. So in a nutshell, in order to make sure that your scat sounds really good and is very palatable and in fashion for the music that we have today, regardless of your genre, you can just keep it short, keep it sweet, make sure your scat syllables are simple. If you're not good at improvising the melody, just scat over the existing melody and make sure that you don't do too much. And then when you get really good at it, you can 
go and book yourself a gig at a jazz club and overindulge on massive like seven minute eight minute long scats yeah because <laughs> it's expected but um no seriously it could be a lot of fun but i hope you've enjoyed this video um please let me know if you do did enjoy this one about scatting and kind of more of a jazz sort of based video um let me know in the comments below and if you want some more free singing training head on over to singersecret.com and you can grab it there thanks for watching i'm nicola milan talk to you next time